Here we are at the mouth. So what I want to do is thoroughly fan cast the main channel emptying out into the intercoastal. Hopefully we'll pick up a trout inside the center portion of it. I don't know how deep it is. It's eight and a half right here. So that's fairly decent for trout traffic. <laughs> Just had a blow up right over here. I'm traveling the intercoastal right now, trying to make my way to another marsh. All right, just put the rod away for a second. But there was another blow up right here. I don't know if it's going to be mullet or not. We got a oh yes we got him we got him i said we got a cast on it <laughs> whoa whoa bro okay he's under the kayak we got to get him out from under there there he goes all right <laughs> look at that little little mud chicken right here guy was trying to cause hate and discontent going under my kayak oh look at that this is the first time I have ever caught a red on the intercoastal as I'm making my way to the marsh uh, wow I saw him blowing up on bait look at this nice little mud chicken right on the outside this is actually my second one the first marsh that y'all saw me in only produced another one of these right here and uh, I didn't get it on video because the GoPro pooped itself so we got to make sure that this one is on video let's oh yeah we're recording man it's kind of crazy whenever you can't trust your gear to do what it's supposed to do but yeah look at this nice little mud chicken right here you gonna let him go he was busting up on bait and Man, those guys are so awesome to fight. Extra light bait casting rod. Oh man, I almost lost my slap spoon. And check it out on Heath's curl tail bug. These things are money. I am so glad that he restocked me and uh, I'm able to use these once again. They produce so many reds, it's insane. So I'm gonna look forward to catching all kinds of guys. There we go. Boy, that is the catch of the day. <laughs> Way to go. Just keep on. We gotta keep trying, baby. Bouncing it off the bottom. Oh, that lure will catch anything. I thought it was a pinfish. <laughs> it's a little mud nugget. <laughs> gotcha, little buddy. Man, I can't catch much else. So uh, why not pull the ultralight out and go after some little mud nuggets? These guys are fun to catch too. He's got enough muscle on him to make this little rod bend. Way to go, son. Learning while you're young. <laughs> Good job. Cool beans. Today has been a day of adversity. And despite all odds, I managed to catch me a six piece nugget meal with a side of two rats. <laughs> It is crazy conditions right now. The day started off really good with very low winds. We had an incoming tide. I mean, it's still incoming. It has been very slow water movement. And the reds, they just, they're nowhere to be found right now. The trout, I have yet to see any trout in here. I managed to hook a couple of sheepies, but they got off right before the boat. And I think that's it. I shall end it right now because I don't want to prolong the inevitable. I was skunked. No keepers today. Really tough going. Uh, the conditions started out really nice and good, but uh, the fish just aren't here. There's plenty of bait, just no fish. I 
went to one section of the Freeport Marsh and there was really nothing there. I caught a rat over there and then I made a two mile pedal up into this area of the marsh and again, nothing. All right, uh, before ending, I want to throw a really big shout out to my newest patrons to the channel, Derek Schaefer. I really appreciate your generosity, brother. John Moyes, thank you so much for that donation. Peter Dry, wow. Okay, so for that level of support, uh, the reward is three vinyl stickers. Just let me know what color you would like, the white ones or the black ones, and those guys will be in the mail to you as soon as you let me know. Jonathan Salea, thank you so much. And also Clinton Marchand, I really appreciate all y'all support to each and every one of you patrons without your help i would not be able to come out here and fish as often as i do to continuously provide y'all with the entertainment you've come to love so that is it if you enjoyed this video i wish they could all be winners um sometimes you just get skunked like this and i'm not afraid to post a skunk so uh, yeah, again, if you enjoyed the video, click the thumbs up. If you're watching the video for the first time and you wanna see more, click that subscribe button. Until next time, tight lines, everyone. All right, fish, video's over. Sleeves are coming up.